my hair today, man. I need a haircut. Anyway, um, welcome back to Wet the Face. And uh, in honor of Shaver Heaven coming back online, and they are the, an Australian company that uh, is a small batch type of artisan who creates some really great shaving soaps. Uh, one that I picked up, and I have a few, uh, is Coconut Citrus Sorbet. Now my label is a little bit messy because I've had this for a while and um, I'll tell you Oh boy It's it really is heaven when you when you when you uh, Just take a whiff of this. It's just incredible. The other one I have is a lemon one and uh, It's just uh, just as good. So what we're gonna do in honor of uh, Shaver Heaven, we're going to put this in a bowl, lather it, bring it to the face, and talk about the results. So uh, let's get to it. Don't go away. Okay, so you can see the bowl is empty, and uh, here is the tub in question. Now this, of course, is an older tub. So you may not see these when, uh, when he's um, back online and you uh, purchase yours, um, but uh, nonetheless, I don't know if the formula has changed, but uh, this is the soap, and uh, mine is not too soft, but but not uh, a hard kind of soap. And we're going to take this, and we're going to put it right in the bowl, and then we're going to do a lather. So let's get to it. All right. So as you can see, the soap is in the bowl. Everything looks great. Uh, we are going to use. A Zen Shave brush today, along with the A, along with the R89 Grand. So uh, that's going to be our tools for today. There's a Merker blade in there. No, I'm sorry. There is a Wilkinson blade in there. So with that, let's just uh, wet this down with some warm water. And we're going to empty the contents of the brush right in the bowl, and then we're going to begin to lather. So here we go. So this is a little thirsty. I think we're going to add some water just in a second. scent is really the coconuts huh <laughs> just amazing Yep, here we go. I think we've got it. Wow. Okay. Here we go. Let's bring this to the face and continue to shave. <laughs> All right, we're back and uh, let's uh, wet the face. I've had about uh, five days growth, so let me wet the face. Get the brush in a second. <clears throat> and here is that brush. Look at all that lather on there. So let's apply it right now. It's going on really nice. And by the way, this soap is a few years old and still acts like the day I bought it. The 
So people with soap collections, you know, it'll last. It's very creamy, it goes on really nice. As you apply it, it gets thicker. And uh, the scent just stays strong. Here we go. Enough for two more passes. And now I'm going to grab the R89 Grand. And here it is. Let's wet it a little bit. And let's start the shave. Here we go. Yeah, I didn't know what the uh, story was with uh, Shaver Heaven. Um, it might have been something in his in their personal lives that they had to take care of, which is why they closed things down for a while. And I understand the reasoning behind that. Sometimes you gotta focus on what the important things are. Like family. And all the stuff you just have to leave behind. Yeah, he was down for quite a while. This and uh, the coconut citrus, um, just really great. Um, it's it's still lingering a little bit. <clears throat> very nice, uh, very close shave, uh, slickness and glide, no problem whatsoever. Um, and of course, the uh, the soap was a little a uh, little hard because uh, the water had uh, dried out uh, of the soap because it's like three four years old, and that's normal for uh, soaps like this to to dry out. Um, a lot of people prefer, like when you're making uh, bar soaps, a lot of people prefer um, letting that uh, bar cure for more than six weeks. Six weeks is like the minimum. Uh, you can even let it go even further. Uh, could sometimes a year, um, <laughs> believe it or not, and you get a very hard bar of soap with a lot, of, a lot less water in it, which uh, in turn, it lasts a little longer. So. Um, you know, a lot of people, uh, a lot of manufacturers who are, um, you know, big manufacturers, they do that. They do like three mil process where they they put it through a shredder and they, they reprocess it, which takes out more of the water and they keep doing that. And that's where you get that three mil uh, process uh, for some of the shaving soaps. That's how it's done. So um, with that said, um, I had a great shave and uh, go out and get you some. Uh, shaver heaven it is fantastic and uh, I hope you have a great shave too and I'll see you next week